Reporting along Highway 18 here in Jackson, and I want to show you guys really quickly uh, what we're dealing with out here. And uh, this is an 18-wheeler along the I-20 ramp to get onto the interstate uh, off of Highway 18 near IHOP and Walmart. And you can see this 18-wheeler has slid across the entrance ramp and is blocking the ramp so folks are not able to get onto I-20 going east. Now, we have seen some folks going around the truck uh, not necessarily the safest thing to do uh, but some folks have braved it to go around this truck and apparently the reason the truck is uh, stopped like this because it could not make it up this ramp and i'm being joined now by uh, kevin he is a truck driver and he says that he's been here since 11 30 last night basically stuck in the jackson area and uh, you saw what happened with this truck tell everybody what happened he pulled up behind there and tried to back up and just slid over and uh, you've been uh, driving trucks uh, for a while. Uh, how would you say uh, the road conditions are, in your expert opinion, uh, as far as like travel for folks this morning? It's going to be real slow. And it's very, very icy. And it's just, it's really thick out here. And uh, is, is this uh, one of the worst that you've seen? I know you've traveled all over the country. Is this one of the worst that you've seen? Or how bad would you characterize this right now? I say it's really bad. It's really bad? There, I've had some really bad ones out in Wyoming also, but but here's pretty bad. Yes. All right, thank you so much, and uh, be safe out there. Yes, sir. And again, you know, I want to show folks at home uh, also, uh, we were talking about uh, the actual road on Highway 18. You see it is frozen solid. Now, this is ice. This is actually not pavement that I'm rubbing my feet on. The pavement is under maybe about a half an inch of ice right here. And in some areas, like right here in the middle, the ice is even thicker. This may be an actual inch of ice. So folks, it is extremely cold out here. And uh, you know, you see some folks right now trying to turn around, move. They're moving very slowly. If you have to be out on the roads this morning, we've been telling you all day, please drive extremely carefully. If you don't have to be out on the roads, please stay at home. And uh, James, I want to just uh, zoom in over there to the uh, right-hand side. This is I-20 East, and you can see a lot of 18-wheelers, some of them moving very slowly, but a lot of those 18-wheelers have completely stopped because, like uh, Kevin was saying, uh, the truck driver we just spoke to, the conditions are extremely dangerous. This ice is really thick, and it is making driving uh, almost impossible in some areas, and especially some of these ramps uh, to get onto these on-ramps and uh, these exit ramps as well. And uh, I see a truck over there that looks like it just ran out the road not too long ago. So, folks, if you have to be out this morning, please, please take precaution. If you do not have to be out on the roads, please do not. Again, Highway 18 in South Jackson near the Walmart and IHOP, if you plan on getting onto Interstate 20 going east, you're not going to be able to because this 18-wheeler right here is blocking that ramp to get on because it tried to go up the ramp, realized it couldn't, and slid back down and blocked the um, entrance uh, to Interstate 20. So make sure, again, if you're going to be out here today, drive extremely uh, carefully and uh, be safe. And if you don't have to be out here, folks, please stay at home. But for now, reporting in South Jackson, Marcus Hunter, 16 WAPT News.